Hey, how's it going, everybody? This is Garrett the Cage. Welcome back to Far Cry 5 on the Xbox One X. And last time we helped out Cheeseburger and ended up getting captured and going through another sequence uh, with Jacob. And that was lovely and insightful and all that kind of good stuff, as you could have guessed. Let me down there, Jack. Grace, wherever you are. Like a dad yelling at kids. Oh, uh, we originally were planning on going up to the radio tower, but I wanted to stop by the Wolves' Den. Uh, to swap out weapons, and I think we had a mission here as well. So, so yeah, might as well. White tails always gotta be prepared. It's got a job for you. You remember the Grand View Hotel? That shithole we pulled you out of? Need you to head back there. Jacob nabbed the white tail by the name of Briggs, and he's using the same brain melting nonsense he tried on you. All in the hopes that Briggs will give up the wolf stand. I don't think our boy can hold out as long as you did. And if he gives up our location, we're done. So we gotta move on this quick. Some folks here think the smart move would be just to off him. But if we start killing our own to save our asses, how's that make us any better than Jacob? Nah, I ain't going down that road. Here's what we're gonna do instead. Wheaties cooked up a little deprogramming package. Same thing we used on you. Need you to swap out the tape they got running in Briggs' room with the one I'm gonna give you. And then, well, then we'll see what happens. If everything goes smooth, our guy comes back to Earth. If it doesn't, well, we'll deal with that when the time comes. Yeah, it doesn't quite work. I will tell you that now. I never I'd like being Trust me, it doesn't work. He's got a gun place around here? So I was looking at my perks needed. I need to get enough kills with the sniper rifle and with the flamethrower. I'm trying to think of which would probably go better here. Flamethrowers are kind of deadly. I'll probably just take that out and about. That'll work. Just enough money. <laughs> Don't come by money in here very easily. All right, girls, out of the way. Take a look at the map. Way up here. There's those helicopters. Hang a right. Hang up this way. And exit. Beautiful. Can I fast travel now that I'm outside? I don't have any points between there and there, huh? I think I can call on a helicopter. I think now that I have the pre order stuff going, I think I have a helicopter waiting for me. To use where I thought I marked it. It just didn't My see it over there. See through. There she is. Who's looking after you? Me, myself, and I. That's fine. All right, girls, who's who's Let's who's right? Both of you are. Shoot. That was a joke. On my well, now that we have a helicopter, let's fly up here and get those. Uh, get that stash taken care of. A sense of driving it, right? Not anymore. Okay, kid. Eli here. 
here. Good, good, good. Cameras. Grand views a straight shot north of there. Get moving. You fucker! Damn, that could have been my last two. <laughs> to be honest, a sniper rifle that close, she probably wouldn't have a head. The bunker should be marked on the map. Once you've got it, pick a spot and go. But Eden's gate has a few hunting parties out. the map. Where do you want me to go? Okay. Let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> Nope, not play not playing the arcade right now. They won't be needing anything now. Okay, it's back in the helicopter, let's get going. We're gonna move, hit those two spots. Then help out the white tail. Hi, girls. I don't think anybody got in. Can't see. Nope. Nobody got in. Did I mark one of those? I thought I marked one. Nope. Oh, this is disorienting. That's the radio tower. What? Now it's marked. No, it's not. Oh, there it is on my screen. I was looking up at the compass. Yeah, this is the way to travel. God, look how much faster we're going. Trucky, trucky. Boom, boom. <laughs> I can see him right over there. No, that should be fine to pick up later. <laughs> like, run! <laughs> oh, jeez.
go. Stash number one, done. You got it? Nice job. On to the next one. Jeez. Yeah, I got the challenge. Look out. Bad woman. Oh, that's what those sounds were. So it was it was actually pinpointing uh animals around me too. That's actually pretty nice. I think Far Cry 3 had that too. $1,000 to refill all ammo, huh? Was that? Shit. That's the last stash. Deputy, you're not too far. Stop those Peggy's from taking off with our supplies. Which one's that? Keep your eyes on the road. I'll do the rest. Can't promise that. Ooh. These trees are really freaking tall. Yeah, without this helicopter, this would have taken forever. I mean, it's not super short, but... I can't imagine spending $1,000, having $1,000 just to blow on more ammo. On this is a little funky, I'm not gonna lie. Let's swing down a bit. Very touchy. Got 
Come on. That's good enough. Come on back to the wolf's den. Alright, girl, see you back. <laughs> We might do that radio tower one while we're out and about. Because you need to do enough points to basically finish up this area. So you kind of have to do those. Not all of them, obviously, but most of these aren't too bad. Ubisoft does, has, in, in more recent times, has done a really great job with their side missions. Even, even back in the old Assassin's Creed days, the old side missions weren't too bad. Where's, where's hideout? It's too well hidden. Ah, way over there. You're gonna help us take this hey. mountain back. Welcome back. Damn. Glad we can actually put this stuff to use instead of letting it collect dust in some bunker. This is a big help. I can't believe you caught those guys. Thought for sure they'd get away. If we had a couple more people like you around here, Eden's Gate would have rolled over a long time ago. Thanks again, Deputy. Bada boom. In planes, huh? I wanted to. I think I'm gonna to try to fly up. So did that? No radio silence. I was like, did that other one clear out too? Way up there. Let's fly up there. Where's my helicopter? Do, do, do. Just keep going. I don't see anything. Deputy, I gotta tell you, some of the white tails, well, some of them weren't so sure about bringing you on board. But they're sure now. Not because of anything I said, but because what you've done. Actions speak louder than words. People are coming from all over to join the white tails. You're giving them hope again. That's been a long time coming. Yep. little box? Is that what I'm trying to destroy? Do I have to... Oh, you're making me go to climb all the way up there, aren't you? You are. You tricky little devils. Nice job! No, there's no way to climb up on there. Ugh. I like sound of that. Oh. Grapple. Yeah, I know. My my driving on a helicopter is not perfect. Heaven forbid I'm not the perfect person. I 
Good thing I bought this perk. Because, you know, gunfire on a sniper round couldn't break this thing. You have to do it by hand. Hope you don't get vertigo. Oh, I am. That was it? That'll do it. Next tower is northeast. It's on a cliff overlooking the hotel. If you got a wingsuit, now's the time to use it. Just try not to crash. I don't have a wingsuit, but I could buy one. Would that make things easier? Where is it at? Four? All right, guys. Well, I went ahead and just cut out that whole section of me taking off from here. Um, I'm not even going to begin. Oh, no. My helicopter's not here anymore. Shoot. Bad news is, like, I, I died horrifically. Uh, not from anything. St no, it was something stupid. I'll take that back. So what happened, I'll tell you, was I ended up wingsuiting. A good distance and do, popping the parachute, wingsuiting, popping the parachute, and got about 300 feet away or 300 meters. Unfortunately, what happened then was um, I couldn't go any further. A, B, Jess then brought the helicopter. Was like, yes, I'm saved. She brought the helicopter, but it um, ended up not landing correctly, and um, I ended up going, okay, fine. I'll, I'll just, I'll just get there myself and try to pop the parachute and ended up falling off the cliff side if we hit a piggy roadblock be careful Let's do this shit. so we're just gonna fly over there I wonder if I should can take these guys down with my rockets and machine guns One. Got another one. Come on. How's that thing still flying? We gotta get him. I mean, this is worth a lot of points. There we go. Blah, 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 blah. Yes, I understand that's what you're doing to your people. I get it. Uh-oh. No. No, no, no. I've I've got shit to do. Okay, guys, I'm going to cut it here and meet you in the next episode. Dang it.
Screw you! I was trying to end an episode! I don't know how that happened. You know, we're flying a helicopter. Oh, you must be hungry. <laughs> Did you know it takes 10 days for civilization to collapse? Yeah. You take away a man's basic needs and he will revert to his primordial instincts in just 10 days. <laughs> That's a difficult thing to understand unless you've lived it. You know, I was in Iraq during the first Gulf War. 82nd Airborne All-Americans. Hoorah! One night, there was a, an ambush. And me and this guy named Miller got separated from the unit. No food. No radio. Nearest base, 200 clicks to the south, so we just started walking. Well, by the third day, I knew we were lost. Day six, ran out of water. You know what that's like, don't you? Difficult to swallow. On the seventh day, Miller's legs started going all wonky. Did you know your brain starts to eat your muscles in order to survive? That's why you're so goddamn skinny. And by the eighth day, the wolves were closing in. And I looked at Miller and I could tell we were as good as dead. And I accepted that. And in that acceptance came clarity. You see, I wasn't just looking at Miller. I was looking at an opportunity. It wasn't something I wanted. It was something that I had to do. It was... It was my test. You see, Miller's sacrifice wasn't about me walking out of that desert. It was about bringing me here. The weak have their purpose. You'll understand that soon enough. Come on. Let's see what happens if I can just run through this. Know your purpose. Okay, uh, well, no, I guess I, can't, I gotta kill people because of the uh, time. There's no way to run through this without with just like that 30 seconds.
about me? What about me? You aren't strong enough. You have to get out of here before it starts again. Follow me. Study the route for weeks. It's the only way out. You'll be safe if you don't. How the hell did we get out here? Uh. The truck wasn't below us. Deputy, if you copy, it's Eli. I don't know where you've gone and disappeared to, but shit. We really kicked the hornet's nest. I know you're probably out there trying to get your friend Pratt back, but us whitetails could still use a hand. Anyways, you know where to find us. Talk soon. All right, guys, I'm going to end it there. I'm not quite sure what the heck's going on, but uh, we'll pick it up in the next episode to keep the excitement going. So, appreciate everybody for watching. Thank you so much. If you can, give the video a like. It does help us out quite a bit. Also, check out the channel because we have tons of videos going on over there. Until next time, you guys, stay frosty.